Hi everyone, I'm Spencer from The Property Rookie. Today I want to share with you 7 key items when we reference towards the leasing of a property in Singapore, a residential property. It can be HDB, it can be private, but I think there are 7 key points you need to take note of when you rent a property. This is good information if you are not aware of it for both tenants and landlords. So coming up, I will split into 7 segments. This is part 1 and we will talk about the letter of intent. So what is the letter of intent? Uh, basically, it sums it up say, by saying that there is an intention that you want to rent an apartment from the landlord, providing you are the, the tenant. So the key points in the letter of intent will be, number one, the price that you are willing to pay for on a monthly basis, the duration of the lease, whether is it 12 months or 2 years or 24 months, other things like request that maybe you want to keep some certain furniture or you want to have a new mattress or new bed things need to be put in into a letter of intent but take note this is an intention it doesn't mean that the owner agrees once they sign on the letter of intent this still needs to be negotiated and importantly to be reflected into the tenancy, group, the tenancy agreement And one more very important thing for a letter of intent, you need to provide a, what we call a good faith deposit of a one month rent. This is to signify that yes, you have a real intention and a sincere one. So you have to provide that amount to the owner. And once the owner accepts, he will sign the acceptance of the receipt of the one month and of course to accept the terms stated there. But important, this information needs to be reflected into the tenancy agreement to make it a legal binding clause and terms so do take note of that and once the letter of intent has been accepted usually it will take two to three working days for the uh, landlord side or the agent to provide the tenancy agreement for you to review so that will be the next phase and look out for part two for tenancy agreement